Hello everyone, Flame Blue Gamer here. Welcome to Let's Play Portal 2. So, let's get this started with the courtesy call. Hooray. Good morning. You have been in suspension for 15 Um. In compliance with state and federal regulations, all testing candidates Hello. <laughs> extended relaxation centers must be revived periodically for a mandatory uh -huh. physical and mental wellness That's great. Exercise. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look up at the ceiling. Tutorials! Look up Good. with the right you stick. Will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. Use the right stick to look down, Good. like, and then you can use, you know, and then you can use the left stick to move, A to jump, B to crouch, X to use stuff which we haven't actually got into yet. Pretty much the same control as Portal 1. Staring at it. <gasps> I'm awake! <laughs> I'm awake! I'm here. I'm, I'm awake. And you can also press right bumper to zoom and zoom out. Oh, I love classical music. Very beautiful. I don't like you, sir. Okay. Yeah, I'll do it. Good morning. You have been in suspension for nine, 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 nine. Hello? Anyone in there? Um, no. No one's in here. Hello? Are you gonna open the door? Nope. Uh-uh. Nope. Nope. Are you gonna open this door? Cause it's- Ha! Ah! Ah! Oh, God. Sphere. Um, good. Looking good, actually. Are you- Hi. Are you- Don't answer that. I'm absolutely sure you are not. There's plenty of time for you to recover. There's not. Just take it. Slow. Please prepare for emergency um, evacuation. Stay calm. Stay, stay calm. Prepare. It's all the same. Prepare. It's great. It's all fine. It's all, all fine. Right. Don't move. I'm gonna get us out. Okay. Oh, you might want to hang on to something. Word of advice. It's great. To you. Um, what do I need to hold on to when? For what reason? Oh, I think that that's quite a good reason. You're right down there. Yes, I'm all right. Can you hear me? Yes. Can. Hello? Yes. Can. You're British. Hello. How are you doing today? Most test subjects do experience some uh, cognitive deterioration after a few months in suspension. Uh -huh. Now you've been under for quite a lot longer. Well, it was nine, 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 nine. That you might have and a then very it continued, minor case of serious brain damage. Really? But don't be alarmed, all right? Uh, although if you do, if you do feel alarm, try to hold on to that feeling because that uh -huh. is a proper reaction to being told that you've got. Thanks. Damage. Do you understand what I'm saying? At all? Does any of this make any sense? Just tell me. Just say yes. Oh my god, I can speak in this game? Cool. Okay, what or you're not. doing there is jumping. <laughs> uh, you, just, you just jump. Yes, I know. Mind. Say apple. Apple. Banana. <laughs> no, okay, I should have said orange. Enough. Just hold tight. Uh, no, no. Um, all alarm. Safeguards are now non Some alarm. Please prepare for That's great. Meltdown. meltdown. Hey, look, I wasn't I know the TV broke. But I'm in pretty hot water here. Uh huh. How are you doing, down there? I'm doing quite terrible. <laughs> Thank you. The reserve power ran out. I, I assume. I get it. Stops waking up the bloody test uh. subjects. Hold on, this is a bit tricky. And of Reckless driving, much? No, why should you tell me anything? Oh no. Why should I be kept? Because you're British. You know about the life functions of the ten thousand bloody test subjects I'm supposed to be in charge of. There well, are other houses, it's kind of like this one over there. Huh. Am I gonna Anderson. make it through? But no, space. no, you don't. Even though I can't talk uh, because I'm new protagonist. Oh, no. I'm new protagonist, and yeah, I can't really say anything. Uh. And whose fault do you think it's gonna be when the management comes down here and finds ten thousand flipping? Vegetables? Um, I don't know what you're talking about. They're all dead. Really? Can I say it's like we're dragging it along? Okay, listen. We should get our story straight, all right? If anyone asks, and no one's gonna ask, don't worry. Uh -huh. If anyone asks, tell them as far as you know. The last time you checked, everyone looked pretty much alive. Yeah. All right. Okay. Not dead. Um. Okay. Hmm. Almost there. Almost here. On the other side Where? of that wall is one of the old testing tracks. Uh huh. There's a piece of equipment in there that we're gonna need to get out of That's here. That's great. I, I think this is a docking station. Oh, it does say docking ready? station. But then it says 500 feet below. 
don't think there's anything down there. That is not a docking station. Oh, it says 500 feet below. Below. No, no, below. If we could go down, that'd be nice. Ow. My spine. Almost there. That's great. You're looking for a gun that makes holes. Uh huh. Not bullet holes. Seems familiar. Don't worry, you'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. Seriously, do hold on this time. Uh. My face. I think we stopped. There we go. Oh, now, hi. I'm honest, you are probably in no fit state to run this particular type of cognitive gauntlet. Uh huh. But, um, but I've done it before. At least you're a good jumper. So <laughs> you got that. You got the jumping on your side. Um, just do your best, and I'll meet you up ahead. Okay, got it. This looks familiar. That's the spirit. Ow, my legs. Hello. And but again, wait, I have to the brace. Science Enrichment Center. Our radio. We are currently experiencing technical difficulties. Currently experiencing technical difficulties. Works. Beyond our control. However, thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. 85.2 FM. My favorite. By instructional and motivational support. See so what this has. Can still be done, even in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural That's collapse. That's great. The portal will open, and emergency testing will begin in three, two, one. Sir, you sound like a certain person I used to know in this place. And if you've played Portal 1, which I LP'd before this, so this is coming right afterward, this should look familiar. Cube and button based testing huh. remains an important tool for but science, I to even this up. in a dire emergency. If cube and button based testing is huh. this emergency, don't worry. The odds of this happening twice are very slim. Because Cubes and buttons cause the apocalypse. Please note the incandescent particle field across the exit. This aperture science material emancipation grill will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through. We know this already, game. Okay. If you feel liquid running uh -huh. your neck, relax. Oh. Lie on your back and apply immediate pressure to uh. your temples. You are simply experiencing a rare reaction in which the material emancipation grill may have emancipated the ear tubes inside your head. So, okay. This seems familiar. If you play Portal 1, just press that button. Go on through. Pick up this cube. And, which kind of glitches through the wall because this is still a source engine. But Just get HUD on in here. Put it on the button. And you can still jump, but you can't bunny hop like you could in Portal 1. But open that portal over there. And here we go. We're done with this. Good. Because of the technical difficulties we are currently huh. experiencing, your test environment is unsupervised. Before re-entering a relaxation vault at the conclusion of testing, please take a moment to write down the results of your test. An Aperture Science Reintegration Associate will remind you for an interview when society has been That's rebuilt. That's nice to know. Only nice to know in case you know. Governed by a manner of animal king, sentient cloud, or other governing body that either refuses to or is incapable of listening to. Ah. <laughs> uh. Okay then. So let us head on in here. The chamber two, like in the original. Hey, you made Uh huh. It. Yes, I did. There should be a, a portal device. Well, you didn't say what it was before. There. But I, I assume. See it though. Maybe it fell off. Do you want to go and have a quick look? Oh, uh, I'll try, but... It's alright, no, go on, just have a look about it. Thanks. Stupid. Arrows. Can you see the no, not yet. The portal just opened, so I assume that it's around here. What's going on? More Ratman stuff. There's Chell, the main character of this game, who is the playable character, and there's, there's Cake, and what is probably assumed to be Ratman, and the companion cube, and then there's GLaDOS, who we killed. So let us keep on going through here. <coughs> Excuse me. Ah, uh, seems very broken down ever since that happened. 
Some yeah. emergency testing may require uh -huh. prolonged interaction with lethal military there aren't androids. Any here. Rest assured that all lethal military androids have been taught to read and provided with one copy of the laws of robots. Uh huh. So either way, I'm going so, to die. Basically. If you feel that a lethal military android has not respected your rights as detailed in the laws of robotics, please note it on your self-reporting form. A future Aperture Science Entitlement Associate will initiate the appropriate grievance filing. Paper. Whoa, grievances! Hooray! Love me some grievances. And here is where we get into some of the more complex puzzles, but they're this still nice pathetically is easy. To help you remain tranquil <gasps> in the face of almost certain death. Smooth uh huh. Will be I love me some smooth jazz. Two, one. Oh yeah. Do, do, do. Smooth jazz sucks. So let us continue here. Here's number four. Again, this is. A basic carbon copy of the first of the first games puzzles. Well, at least for the first part. You might be thinking, "Hey, it's just a rehash of every single level from the first one." <laughs> no. Let's see if I can. I failed to do this in the first game. Yes. Great work. Because this message is pre-recorded, any observations related to your performance are speculation on our part. Please disregard any. Thanks. I'm a terrible person, so I don't need compliments. Ah. Guess that broke out from under us, unlike the first game. What's up here? More Rat Man stuff, but... A cube with cat ears. <laughs> My mind equals blown. So, let us continue downward. Huh. Okay. Um. If the uh -huh. is currently being bombarded with fireballs, meteorites, or yes. other objects from space, please avoid unsheltered testing areas wherever a lack of shelter from space debris does not appear to be a deliberate part of the test. Okay, I guess space debris is a dangerous thing here. But just need to put a pull onto there, press this button, and it should come out and hit me in the face. But. Unlike Portal 1, it does not do damage to you when you get hit by a cube in the head. And I love the ambience and the atmosphere here. So, this button puts up a little shield to make sure the cube doesn't go flying into the acid, which can actually kill you, but I do not want to show it off because I know I'll die later <laughs> a lot. But let's just put the cube here, and we can continue. Well done. The enrichment center reminds you that although circumstances may appear bleak, I'm not alone. Not alone. All aperture science personality constructs will remain functional in apocalyptic, low-power environments of as few as one point. Okay nine. then. So on the next episode, of let's play Portal 2. We will continue down to the facility and try and escape again. So I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.